Hello everyone, welcome back to Mirror Moon EP. Okay, this is the day after my previous episode. On, let's see, on day one, I got the planets to... or I progressed, or watched the solar system or whatever, um, progress to 4% complete. And then yesterday, on the last episode, it was 70%. And now today, it's gotta be maxed or something, whatever happens. If it progressed, um, 66% in one day. It's gotta be done now. So what's gonna happen when I jump in? I have no idea. Is it gonna be 100%? Is it gonna be 95%? And if it is, what then? If there are no new places left to explore, what happens? Let's find out. Twenty-seven percent. What? Unless that's a one? And I misread it? Maybe instead of seventy percent it was ten? Is that a seven or a one? I think it's a one. I I think that's a one, because I think that's a seven right there. Okay, wow, I really wish this font was more readable. It's really hard to differentiate. Yeah, that's a one, isn't it? It looks like the seven actually hangs down. Whereas this just goes to the side, that must be one. Okay, never mind. This is actually not progressing nearly as fast as I thought. Hmm. Okay, well. Wow, I might have to wait like... What? Okay, so it progressed like 10% in one day. So assuming that speed keeps up, then I would have to wait... 8 more days? Hmm. Well, let's... I guess I'm gonna have to sit on this game for a while, but for now, since I'm here... Let's go explore some more planets. Or stars, or whatever they are. Alright, let's go here. <laughs> it's already named, and it's called No Life. Well, damn. Matter? <laughs> Anti and matter. Anti matter. Gray. Oh, this is awesome. Gray, matter, anti, matter, no life, and nope. I don't know if that means, like, the person was asked to name the star, and then the only thing they could think of was, nope, not gonna name it. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Okay, well, I was gonna go there to that cluster, but it looks like someone's already done it. So... Let's go... here. Let's go with medium. <laughs> well... This is kind of disappointing, I have to be honest. I was worried that Going from planet to planet was going to become boring, and it is. The stuff you can do on the different planets is just not varied enough for it to matter. Really, the only thing of significant interest in this game left for me at this point that I know of is the question, the mystery of what's going to happen when this reaches 100%. Yeah, I mean, this is just walk forwards and you're done. I mean, that's not interesting. All right, well, let's name this one Crow after Crow from the longest journey. All right, where are we going next? Hmm, let's go here. Yeah, my patience is um, definitely waning, so I'm not going to be using low fuel for these. 
In fact, this gameplay video is probably going to last like five minutes. Because I'm pretty much out of fuel at this point. The only way to last longer if, if, is if there's a very difficult puzzle on one of these stars. Hey, it's at 22% now. Nice. Okay, this is different. I've seen this sort of like solar grass or whatever you want to call it before, but never had the spawn area and it didn't look like this. And also there's a ring in the sky. What is that ring? Looks like there's a pulse coming from over here. Let's find the epicenter. Uh, oh, is it? No, that's not it. Where's it coming from? Did I go past it? I think this entire planet is covered in these weird light shafts or... You know, I'm just going to call it solar grass because that sounds pretty badass, doesn't it? Okay, let's grab the planet. Now what? Well, there's a bunch of places, so let's just explore it. Shouldn't take long to find something. Yeah, this planet actually is, or star, or whatever it is, is actually significantly different from the others. So this is a nice change of pace. I have also never seen this thing. do anything with it, though. Not yet. Oh, another part. Maybe this will activate it. Nope. Alright, well, I'm gonna hit the pyramid if I go this way. I think I've already been there, haven't I? No, I have not. Never mind. Alright, let's get a look at what we have to work with here. Alright, this is gray. So I probably need to do something with that. Ooh, it's gonna be hard to aim myself. I'm gonna have to turn around. Alright. Um, let me aim in the opposite direction. Right about there? Yeah, and then turn directly around. You can use that as a frame of reference? Okay, that's eh, probably not going to work, but whatever. It's about the best I can do. I just scan from side to side. Oh, never mind, it did work. Oh, and that's the end. Let's name this one Abnax, after Abnaxis, from, once again, The Longest Journey. It's a pretty badass name for a star, doesn't it? Abnax. Let's actually leave that off, because it makes it easier to see where I've been. Alright, let's do one more. Go to that big one, and let's use all of the fuel.
Oh, can you actually see us get close to the star? Look at that. I think that's the one. I think it is. Yeah, it seems to be, like, hidden behind the control panel now, but... Hmm. I didn't know you could actually kind of see it. Ah, those things. My enemies. The things that often lead me nowhere. Let's follow this one. Maybe this one won't trick me. Damn it, I've been tricked. Follow the sound. Here we go, another one of these broken things. I wonder if the fact that it's broken means I can't complete whatever's on the planet, because I know I've had trouble with a planet like this before. One with one of those broken pulse generators. Whoa, solar rain or whatever this is. Whoa. I just activated something. Oh, and that's it. Alright, let's name this one... Clax, after Roper Clax, once again from The Longest Journey. And we are pretty much out of fuel, and it is now at 22%. Okay, well, I guess I'm gonna wait. Like, a week, um, or however long it takes. I mean, I'll keep checking back in to see what it's at. And wait for it to get to 100%, because I'm really curious about what it's going to do when it hits 100%. Or whatever the maximum is. But, at the same time, it's really not interesting enough to go from planet to planet for me to actually continue attempting to up that number. Which is unfortunate. This game is, at the moment, both intriguing but also kind of dull. Which is sad. But, we're not done yet. We'll see what happens when it reaches the maximum. So I will be back hopefully soon, however long that takes. And we'll see what happens then. Alright, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I will be back soon.